Oh, that one little line of blue pixels at the very top gets me. Just barely not big enough, and there's no way to resize it to be the correct size, because it actually, like, thinks that it is the correct size right now, that there's no gap currently. <laughs> I think it goes away once we start playing. Dolphin resolutions can be really weird like that. Most games resize after the, like, press this button to continue screen. Because I guess that's just done in a different resolution in the system. GameCube is a mysterious beast. I haven't seen much of these Earth children. Let's see, last time we made it to, we, we explored the island of Sadal Sud. We acquired a very hungry Pac-Man in our quest Magnus who loves to eat all of our items and whom we've had to trap in jail with some of the few things that he is not capable of eating and only feed him <laughs> things that we approve of, basically. And this entire ridiculous setup is uh, basically standard when you play this game, which is very funny. This game's a little bit silly in, like, really specific ways that are kind of wonderful. Beyond that, uh, the Empire is still doing its pro machination thing. It's, uh, they've basically been courting the de facto leader of this island who has the most salad and fried accent possible. But who eventually admitted to us that he's just actually conning the, um, the Empire for their money. Well, my dear, I'm in it for the money. <laughs> I don't care nothing about them fancy robots they got. I just want their money. But their money spends good. You are correct? Yes! Mizuti! <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Everyone loves the great Mizuti. Everyone loves the great Mizuti. She hasn't been born yet. I know. She's like 10? She's 14, I think. Oh, goodness. In the, uh, in the original game. I'm not sure that people played Origins. <laughs> it, like, I'm not going to say it's the most obscure game we've ever played. No, but, like, we definitely played Bat some, and Kaitos some is already kind of a pretty obscure RPG that I can't really, like, you know, expect people to have heard of. The prequel to it is non-existent, essentially. Yep. Um, especially since Monolith Soft went and found another series that they like developing more than this one and was slightly more successful. But I enjoy Origins. We enjoy Origins. I like it's, Origins. it's an interesting game. Like it's uh, it, it, I feel like it does spend a bit of time spinning its wheels. Um, but like there's a lot of intrigue and it does feel like, you know, if you've played and enjoyed the first one, there are things there are a lot of things to get out of it. We've beaten up Giacomo three times and yeah, he's a whiny yeah, baby. He is a whiny little baby. Mm-hmm. And he's voiced by Yuri Lowenthal, which Yeah, mwah. beautiful. <laughs> anyway, uh we're in Alfard now because our heart flask grew up last time. Oh yeah. 
Oh yeah, we also are gonna put something in that. Oh, when we go back to thingy, we will put, um... The thing we used to get rid of the fireflies. I've forgotten what it's called now. Oh, the dew. The dew, yes. The dew goes we in. We need to do the dew. It goes into the the two apples. The two apples yeah, plus the dew yeah. makes a thing. Makes a thing. Yes, yeah, so we've actually got two recipes on the go. One of which is meat. <laughs> yeah, I feel like my origins didn't come out uh, in the UK. Mm -hmm. It was very end of life. Like Tales of the Abyss, it was at the end of the PS2, and they were like, "Well, we're not gonna lo we're not gonna localize that for for Europe." Yeah, so, and so Origins also uh, got the it's yes. the end of the GameCube as we know it, and so they I, feel fine. So I never played Origins until I came to visit you, mm -hmm. and we played Tales of the Abyss, and we played uh, Origins. Yeah, I did give up my flame ice. Yeah, we'll, we'll be getting some of that. Uh, potentially not even a bad idea to... I was gonna say, them. maybe I actually leave the desert to claim some flame ice. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Not a bad idea. It's gonna take me a bit. <laughs> now, I think, like, overall, Eternal Wings is the better game. Yes, I would agree with that. Um, I mean, Eternal Wings is legitimately one of the greatest video game stories I've ever played. Yep. yep. You want to take more than one or just the one? Uh, just the one. You'll, mm. you'll be getting more. Okay. Thanks to this flame ice, the desert heat is a lot more bearable. I, you can I, run around freely now. I always bring up Bait and Kaifa's Eternal Wings as my favorite plot twist in any video game ever. Yes. It, it truly is one of the best. Yep. It plays with the the, the fact that you are playing a video game in just more, a really smart way. Yeah, more than almost any other... Oh yeah, we should feed the sunlight Ah, of course. We need to feed the sun pa to Pac-Man. Pac-Man <laughs> deserves some mother sunshine and, you know, it would make his day. A delicious mother sunlight. Yeah, mother sunshine. Shine some light on this horrid creature. Mm-hmm. Wait! <laughs> I want to talk to Georg. We're here to talk to Georg. We're here to talk to Spiders Georg because there is a literal heart growing in our heart flask. Mm, yeah, it's, it's a little nasty. I ain't into that. Hit you. Hit me. Might I have a look? Should I show him Pac-Man? <laughs> I've got a horrible creature. I, uh, you know, I don't think it'll do anything, but... He just thought oh, he just, <laughs> just came out of the conversation. He, just, no, he came no he shit. He just went down into like a thinking pose like he's oh, disappointed man. in me. He didn't like Pac-Man. <laughs> mm, yes, that shall prove useful. Alright, you have to wear it out. Don't mind me. <laughs> it's doing great, kid. <laughs> Yeah, he, he just, really he did. did. He looked. <laughs> he sure did. <laughs> Will do. Yeah, I think it like can't continue to grow. Oh wait. Oh yeah, there it is. No, it oh, can. he moves it. He moved and... it, but it can. It grows without him. You okay. just get dialogue for showing him every. He version. just says cryptic bullshit. Yeah, he um, says cryptic bullshit at you. We've yeah. also got. Uh, the wanted posters. Classical wanted posters, which are going to sit in our inventory and tank our health for. Uh, so long. Uh, 30 hours? <laughs> 30 literal hours. At some point we just leave the game running. Yes, we funny. will. When we don't want to, like, when we don't have anything else that we're also trying to age. <laughs> that's, that's also true. It's, it's the funny thing that we're going to have. Although, like, very rarely are we going to have things that are like, you know, if this ages, it ruins our lives. Um, but yeah, we'll probably just pick a time to keep it running. All right, so, um, it's never going to not happen. That's fair. We're heading back. I don't think there's anything else for us to do. No. Why you? 
So, yeah, uh, it, it sounds like the Empire, or uh, Bale Height anyway, is gonna promote machinates that they'll sue the weather. Rodolfo wants it or not. Shocking, really. Yeah, I know, weird. I'm going to kill this motherfucker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not know. even going to thing here because he's so yeah, he's, dead. He's dead, he's dead as hell. He's a level beyond dead. The card, the heart of the cards is also really killing me here. Like, at least twice now I've had a weapon for someone on deck. Fine. It's fine, I just gotta warm up. It is. Wow, I was about to queue up a very funny combo, and the game was like, nah. Now he's dead. What, what are you doing? This is a baby. What are you doing? Ah. Baby. It's meat. Yeah. Meat, 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 meat. Phoenix Pac-Man. Yeah, 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 Mr. yeah, Mr. Lean yeah, Meat, yeah. that means you, Olgan, saw something this fatty on his table, he would have a fit. <laughs> Fascinating. Oh, okay. <laughs> Fuck you, Ogun, I guess. <laughs> Alright, so it's what's it called? Well done, meat? Oh. Well done, meat. Well done, meat. I, I have a Pac Man list that I am uh, keeping track of for mm -hmm. us, by the way. Yep. Uh, we're only chance one. gave the eternal sun. I, I, have, I have a checklist for us. So we are uh, we're hopefully, hopefully keep on top of that, and I won't. Make a mistake. I've done that before. We, it wouldn't be the first time. It would not be the first time. Uh, but hopefully I, uh, I don't fuck. Do my best. On the plus side, at least I'm playing this so I don't have to watch the Flyers. Oh, are they losing? It's 2 nothing, and they were both shorthanded oh. goals when I last looked. <laughs> oh. Well, I'm told worse things happen at sea. Allegedly. So when we get back to Sadal Sud, uh, pretty much the only place we can now go, um, other than of course the town we land in, mm -hmm. uh, is the north part of the pass that we went through. Yeah, so we were told, like, or, uh, Hughes is his name, told us that, uh, Hughes. They're gonna baronachinate this land whether Rodolfo says he says okay or not. Uh, and he's gonna go do it in the pass here, so... That's where we actually have to go for the story. Thank you, Quentin Flynn. It's not Quentin Flynn, it's uh, Crispin Freeman. Mm -hmm. A shitty one. Well, this looks a little bit different. Didn't the animals are still fucking? Probably. <laughs> when we came here the first time, the animals were... Uh, Boning down. And extremely amorous, mm. shall we say. I'm pretty sure it's illegal to go into another country and build a cell phone tower. <laughs> I just, like, call it a guess. Damn it, who's stopping them? What about Rodolfo? Fuck him. But Hughes pushed forward against his wishes. Yeah, they don't have to care. They don't yeah. seem to care. They don't About have the sovereignty to care. of other islands. <laughs> They're just doing imperialism. We'll try, sir. But he's likely to bring out a Machina Arma. And those things always kick our ass. Yeah, a little bit. I think we can stop him if he does. Yeah. Yeah. Can you send us any backup? Bale height has a lot. Even in the army. I can't make things happen the way I used to. Well, it sounds like you kind of suck at this, and yeah. we backed the wrong horse to become emperor. Yeah, I think so. I think we definitely uh, are on the losing side here. Right now, you're all I can count on. Oh, that's, uh, that's not, that's not great. We kind of suck, sir. <laughs> It's not great news that uh, they're relying on us. At 
least the bats are still here. They love it. The, for the forest is it. on fire. There should be a chest. Head okay, over to the right, down the cliff, up, chest nearby, and then head south, get some flame ice. You will need three, apparently. And Gil is asleep, as usual. Yeah. Lazy bum. <laughs> Gil's, uh, Gil's sleepy. They, they're, they've got a difficult job. They, they've got a lot of work. Oh, they're up. And poisoned. No, this arabesque is at least going to hit everyone. Excellent! <laughs> we'll see if Gilo lives. Oh, that's so sad. We've just got the perfect Millie loadout here. Barely missed here in the level five. He gets so excited. He does. I love him. This battle really does just take forever because there's so many fucking enemies in it. Right. There's it, it, still there's one like, left! I do think this battle system only lasts longer than the original games. I, it's a little difficult. They both it's are hard to say because yeah, they're all long. very like, you know, single target, blow up this enemy kind of things. But you also could juice your deck a lot more, I think. Sir, could you not do that, please? I, I would really prefer if you put the napalm away. I think the thing is because everyone had their own individual attacks, enemies died when they died. Mm -hmm. I think all the time you're like, yes, the chain when you attacks like can. It, yeah, like sometimes it's just like that enemy was dead like five years ago. It does, you really it, didn't have to do this to him. You, you didn't have to do it to him. We did though. We did have to do it to him. You knew you had to do it. We to knew him. we had to do it to him. Get more CP. Nope, only really got knocked down. Sad. Hey, just barely enough. <coughs> I believe combos also do ramp damage. Oh, it's not always conveyed in the clearest manner. Okay, that's two people, so... Bandages. This is bound to hurt. I should have equipped the weapon. Oops. I mean, at least the, uh, the battle theme rocks. Yes. And that is important. Fuck it, why not? Fuck this guy specifically. Ooh, we actually had it up for the seven there. I do think one thing that I would definitely give this game uh, as like really interesting is that 
I feel like I, an RPG changing the battle system this much, like, in this day and age, like, in the day and age that this game came out, was really unheard of. It was much more of, like, a PlayStation 1 SNES kind of thing to, like, totally change and iterate on your battle system between uh, oh, yeah. oh, releases, yeah. especially in a JRPG. Mm, oh, God, yeah. That was a two-minute encounter. <laughs> Alright, so yes, there's a chest here, and there is no way I'm not fighting that tiger for it. That's like the opposite of the one I should have picked. Love that for me. It shows so smart, like. Oh, these things happen. Ooh. This dungeon is definitely very difficult to uh, get away from enemies. Yes, and it has some really annoying encounters in it, too. Like, this fight is fine, but the fly fight, like, like the bat fight, which has five of them, is is really just, like, there's not really much you can do against that many enemies. And then sit there and grumble at them. Yeah. May my blade be sharp. Oh, that is such a shame. I almost had the funny combo. Well, I do at least get to do a triple with, uh... Gilo. That's fun. Never mind. Thanks for making it easy. I mean, fights in both of these games are definitely, like... Fairly intensive, fairly long, even for random mm -hmm. encounters, but they're, you know, like, the battle system is fun enough that I don't tend to mind it. You really do just like playing the little mini-game. Alright, so I did get the, uh, ice fan weapon there. Nice. Art. Thingy. And it doesn't want to give us nothing for nobody. Okay, so south is the flame ice. Alright. This guy was in the way. May my blade be sharp. This is bound to hurt. Two, three, four, five. Take any kind of healing at this point. Yeah. Not her. Oh no. <laughs> her. Oh well. <laughs> My one wish. Sorry, Millie. Really. Well, just beat them without her. Guess we'll see. <coughs> I do feel like the first game did not have the heal to full between fights, but I could be wrong because it has been long enough for me to forget it. Um, like, and I do think that that's a good thing. I think that's pretty cool. All right. Hmm. What? Is that what it was supposed to be? What did you add to it? Oh! I didn't add anything to it. It uh, took too long. I guess there is okay, a time so limit. There is a time limit. Okay. Well? I'm feeding, I guess. I guess. Is that on the list? Let's see if he likes it. Not on the list, but uh, I guess we can still feed it to him. Oh, we did get the Magnus stockpiler for it. Lord knows if it's doing anything what is it to called? us. 
I think it was like Magna Mess Up. I thought so, I'm just making sure, because yeah, it's not, uh, not on the list of things to feed him. We'll see if he eats it. Yes, there we go, we do in fact have a, uh, cat keep things in the mixer forever. There you go. That's good to know. Man! Here, I brought flame ice. They said the crane had overheated. They set the fucking forest on fire! You little arsonists can deal with problems you've caused yourselves. <laughs> Fuck this! <laughs> yum yum, flame ice. Mm hmm. We ate a bunch of it, I have no He's idea. He's not eating it. Oh boy, can we delete it? Uh, well, hmm. We don't really have room for another flame ice. He will eat it. I guess we could, like, trundle him up more. Like, just, uh. Yeah. Jail for Pac Man. Yeah, jail for Pac Man. <laughs> Extremely jail that Pac Man. We're aging several of these things. And we had the salty water that we wanted to do with something. Uh. The guy said to pick it up. Okay. So um, it'll show up if I it... don't know why the guide wanted to pick it up. Like, That's I fair. The guide wanted to pick it up. I follow, I follow the whims. Mm hmm Let's just check it. Yeah, it says... Go back up, you'll find there's a bridge installed across the waterfall. Very kind of them. And then yeah. in the crane there. Yeah. Ooh! Ooh! Ah, Callus is busy having his ass kicked. These things happen. We'll see if I uh, suffer for getting rid of that. May my blade be sharp. Man, the game does not want to give me shit. Going to kick this man's ass. Yeah, you are. <laughs> Soggy help. <laughs> you win. Nice. I win. Hey, you do. Bridge might be a strong word for that. <laughs> Stupid crane. Get that damn crane out of the way. It's overheated, yes. Yeah, so we're gonna need to, uh, going to cool it down with some flame ice. The perfect can. Cool it down with Pac Man. Yeah, Pac Man will cool it down for sure. Uh huh. Probably eat it. I mean, I can imagine Pac Man work. would, like, eat the, that crane. We need that crane. It's making a path. Uh, so you have to go back up there and yep. go across, yeah. This would be very fun. I think just setting the forest on fire. Yeah! How else did you pro machinate it? Yes, I can't believe I got away from him. <laughs> we don't need forest, we've got machines. Hi. Hey. I like how we don't... I guess we can fight them. Oh yeah, no, we've I've, that's all the uh, guys I've been fighting with these. Just fighting them for funsies. Mm-hmm. Reach the next screen. Continue along the path straight down southwest. Use more flame lines on the next crane. Man, the heart of the cards kind of fucking hates me right now.
thank you, card of the cards. You're really coming through for me here. Three different people's special. May my blade be sharp. I think she does self care. Hilo can throw on the Sophia. They do have a uh, thing coming. I should probably dump some of these terrible cards in my grandfather's deck. No, your grandfather's deck has no bad cards! I found a few! What cards? Most of them. No! What bad cards? Aw, it denied me the, uh, the funny combo. Aw. Because it was a not a special attack D. Yeah. I believe that would have been. Yep, yep. That said, this man is D.E.D. -E dead. Good. Give me an awful lot of, like, ones after I can't play enough cards to get to the one. <laughs> We seem to just hate Soggy right now as uh, as his guardian spirit. Yeah. Wait, did we annoy him at some point? I don't know. I don't think so. I didn't do nothing. Ah, yes. This crane stands erect. Ah. I mean, I guess that's a, that's a way to fight back. <laughs> Just drive it into the, uh... Yeah! Just up there. Yes, that I couldn't get before now. I kind of went up to the left, but I wonder if That I can't get no. until I go up the other way. Yeah. There's, uh, things in the way. Mm Alright, so there's definitely no not fighting these guys here. Granted, probably not the worst thing for me to take a whole bunch of fights. I thought I had a one in there, I did not have a one in there. Sad and pathetic. That said, the fight's over anyway, so, you know. My burst combo did win the day. Sorry, Mr. Forest Animal. Thanks for the battle shield, though. But yeah, there's a whole bunch of these blockers that stop the other bits of it. Ooh, Kusanagi. Well, they do say to fight fire with fire. That's true. Don't know if there's a fast way to the bottom of this deck. <laughs> That's pretty good. My, uh, my guess is no. I don't think so, but I don't know for sure. Ah, so we finally found something larger yeah. than the upgraded parched sword that we have been rocking for yeah. an abnormally long time. Because I think once we get to the next screen and then cross the river the other way, we'll yes. be able to go back yes, up this it path. Says, yeah, another one. Uh... It's being really mean to us. Little crane. Stop gushing. Oh, but it's it loves you. It's... Stop gushing. 
Oh, but it, it just wants to express how much it loves you. It's gushing all over you. Wow. Fair enough. I was trying to go around you, sir. Sure. Go off, Millie? I think he might be. Yes, the crane will make another chance to the land. Mm -hmm. you can get a chest, and towards Northwest you'll find another chest. Also get this guy's ass. Yeah, a little bit. I love, I love how excited he is. It's Level so good. Five. Gets you pumped. And then the siren starts. <laughs> it's true. I'm sure the forest burning is uh, the highlight of their weeks. It's some extreme welcome to bonus stage, yes. <laughs> Ah, Rotting Mountain Apple. Ah! So that's nice, another nice one that will, uh, yeah, yeah. let us pack, man. Yep. Yes, this one lets us go up the path as opposed to over to that flower. <laughs> that's all right, we will expand Pack Jail briefly, but not too much. <laughs> <coughs> We do at least have more room now. Well, we know where that the flame ice is, and we are actually, you know, coming up to the boss. We have a few chests to grab first before yep. you. A twin ice auger if you need it. Mm-hmm. Okay, so that one's on the other side of the uh, split that we'll go to once we get there. Because they put up all these barracks and we just can't, or barricades and we just can't do anything about it. I think to the west there is the boss. Oh, okay. I'm not gonna relay here. Yeah, that's where the boss fight is. Okay. Weird where they put the safe point then. Yeah. <laughs> is what I would say. Yeah. Unfortunately, you may want to go back to it. I'm going to grab the chest up here and then yes. go back to yes, it. Yes, yeah. grab the chest and then go back to it. Yeah. yeah. No, that, that, all, that was definitely yeah, It's very unfortunately there's like a series of boss fights coming up. <laughs> It was just the one I'd maybe blag it, but, uh... But several cutscenes are about to play in succession. Several cutscenes, and then several boss fights, and we wouldn't want to have to redo this whole level as well. <laughs> that is an awkward place to put it. Right? Like, again, I was kind of confused already when it did that. Uh, you know, like, when, when the flower was the place that it was, because it's like, that doesn't really seem, like, correct. <laughs> oh, shit, we're close to this, too. Yeah? I thought we might be. Yeah, we are. This is bound to hurt. Soggy is having a nap. Excellent. Oh, just napping here. Predictable win. Sleepy deepy hours. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay, so the guy does get the... It doesn't say it gets the save, it gets, but it gets the chest. Right, by right the next save. to the save. And then comes up the I, crane. I was sort of um, like, I don't know why just, they put the save just, there. Use the flame ice of the crane, approach a path to the left where you can find a twin ice auger. Or to the northwest you can find an emerald thrush, but otherwise take the crane, but it's like, but it gets the chest. Like, that chest, the twin ice auger was 
across the crane. That seems a bit fucking strange to, like, get that chest, go down the crane, and then go back up the crane. Sometimes guys are laid out, uh... Man, they got Gilo's ass! Inserted ...in extremely strange ways. Mm -hmm. And, yeah, I didn't realize that it meant... It, it meant don't go up the crane, despite the fact that, you know, it tells you to go up the crane. Mm-hmm. Knocking Gilo the fuck down. Attention. Take it. Just don't like Gilo, which why? Gilo's the greatest. <laughs> Jesus. My goodness. Hating, just haters. They really are. Here. Hilo immediately chooses violence. Always, obviously. There's no reason for me to do what I'm doing here. It might, in fact, be actively deleterious. Yeah, you should probably not. But he's dead, so it's fine. Uh, I guess it worked. It was the good and correct decision. Sorry about that. It doesn't make that true. It was the good and correct decision. No, I don't think I'm gonna give it to you there. You're <laughs> not under any circumstances. And I don't tend to hand it to you. That's a lie, I do tend to hand it to you. See, oh god. I hate it! Go away! Just need to wait a little longer. It does mean he's gone once we save. Yeah, I'm helping. Woo! Level two. <coughs> All right, I get a little extra time to uh, set up attacks here. That guy better be fucking dead. that this is the last fight I have to do. <laughs> Attention. You know, that the, that the enemies don't unionize and block my path. It only hope. I mean, at least all of this is all of this cacophony has happened on this screen, so like the enemies haven't respawned. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You go back. Thank God your tail is in a hitbox. Oh my God. 
Okay. There isn't a guy here. But we made it. <laughs> There's the last chest. Hey, can we stop having it be on fire, please? No. This is terrible. Eh. Hughes, what do you think you're doing? The trees are ugly. What does it look like? I'm removing what's in the way. Makes for a good show, doesn't it? <laughs> I love starting forest fires. Mm. No. The people of Sadal Suit need this forest. Make your men stop right now. No. N no. Why should I? You no. Bring me my Machina armor. That's it. I'm getting me mallet. But I didn't even say no. He just went like. Oh, fuck these guys. Let's remove the trash. Hey, get me my armor, please. Hey, we're talking to you. <laughs> and I'm ignoring you. La 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 la. Fussing. You'll get your chance to fight me right now. Can I, can I get that chest? No, never. I think we might actually not be able to get that chest for a long time. Probably. I think, un I think unlike... Uh, the dude in uh, Diadem, I I think that's probably behind the optional fight, if I had mm. to guess. We'll see if the guide's come and get it. Oh, fuck. <laughs> yeah, so his back of the armor is uh, a gun. He's, he's stolen Barrett's hand <laughs> cannon. Get ready to think your dying thoughts. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, fuck. Here he comes. <laughs> All right. Okay, when he starts charging, he's gonna do a lot of damage. It's a good thing I don't play defense. Yeah, it's pretty much going to be a KO whoever it hits, so you just like, you see him charging, just dig to your uh, reviving item. What about my threes? Uh, you, you can take your threes. Take care, leave me a freeze. It's always great when Christopher Freeman voices a sicko, it's true. <laughs> the nasty man coming up. He already does so much damage. What the fuck am I supposed to do with this? <laughs> Relay, baby! Oh, there's two over there. The game is not, uh, we're not believing the heart of the cards. Really. No. You need to believe more in the heart of the cards. We do not, in fact, believe in fairies. Uh, I didn't actually like, realize who I was on. Yeah, because Saga got knocked the fuck out. Now it makes yeah. sense. Mm -hmm. He is probably gonna die. He's he is gonna on die. Fire. Yep. This boss fight is tough. Mm -hmm. Ah, someone's about to explode. Kind of like all of these armor fights, he does not have much health, but you also do not do much damage, so. Yeah, he caught me at a pretty fucking bad time, I would say. Yeah. That earring's probably pretty on. Yeah. Good enough. Oh. 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 Hey Boy, well, the heart of the cards is really not coming through Fate Day. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's the Fate's Cordial. <laughs> More like the Late's Cordial. You're about to get Uh-oh. Here. Well, if we're all at low health, it doesn't really matter. 
point where I'm actually gonna wait on purpose so that he murders someone, uh, and then I heal someone else. Hi, Billy. What a jerk. May my plate be really hates Millie. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I've been doing nothing but dumping her stuff. <laughs> oh, no, no. No, we Fire make it. Yep, we made it. It's very funny that that's. Let's get that off the screen. <laughs> Man, we sure do suck at this. Yeah, a little bit. At least we get the experience. <laughs> the experience of getting your ass whooped. And it really does happen an awful lot. <laughs> you, you spend the entire first disc losing horribly. He's too powerful. Frankly, I think Virus' plan kind of sucks nuts. Yeah, it does a little bit, yeah. Send three, uh, three kids who don't know what they're doing Complete to their, randos. To their deaths, yeah. Save the whining for another time. Get up, Gilo, and fight! You get up for fight! Uh-oh. This time we'll get him, yeah! <laughs> Toxic yeah! positivity, let's, let's go! Let's go! Damn right. That's what I want to hear. That's what he wanted to hear, and that's why we said it. <laughs> Our heart of the cards has been failing us today. Maybe we are on Saki's good side, it'll happen. Mm -hmm. said you're Phil. I'd like to get this over with. Oh, hey, Shanap. Hi. What's taking so long? Lord Balehite is waiting for your report. I'm burning a forest down. Rome wasn't burned in a day, bro. If it isn't Sagi. Have you been pestering Hughes? Yeah. A little bit. <laughs> Your timing couldn't be better. As it happens, I've brought something fun for you to play with. Oh, for oh. fuck's sake. <laughs> it's me. Be a deer and drop the cargo over Nunki Valley. No, that's all right. I'm giving you clearance. Just do it! If you would. <laughs> Such an angry little shit he is. What was that about? Oh, he's an angry shithead. He's a real bastard man. Can see for yourself. I mean, he's quite a bastard man. Kirk Thornton. Nasty. Nasty. So, uh... <laughs> yes! 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 <laughs> Playmate! Aww, baby! Arthur's baby! The Manticore cometh! Arthur's a baby! I love him! An afterling? What a what now? You know, it's an afterling. So the, the game, I guess, just pulls an afterling out of its ass that looks completely different from all the ah, other ones. Ah, there's a reason it looks different. Mm. This one's an unexpected acquisition, a mongrel. Its host was a wild... So all the other hosts you've seen were people? Were people. And this was an animal. Mm-hmm. And that's why it looks I different. having it brought to Lord Balehide, but waste not, want not. <laughs> <laughs> He's such a nasty man! Why are you such an nasty man, Shanaf? I feel like you shouldn't be this nasty of a man. When we could use it to take care of Soggy first. I, I could have just killed him, actually. <laughs> like yeah, this, this doesn't seem very. I was kicking his ass. This actually seems like a bad idea, Shanaf. <laughs> gotta gotta say, not the smartest idea you've had. Eh, 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 eh. No. 
trouble him. We're killing two birds with one stone. Snake. Yeah, Shanaf definitely has his own deal going on. Has at least some on. cross purpose, yeah. Oh, look at that thing, it's nasty. Like he's working for Bailheim, but he's clearly also got his own agenda. Yep. Oh yeah, this guy's pretty tough, apparently. Oh boy. Danger! Negative penalty. One plus. That's more like it cards. Well, <laughs> unless she's dead. So yeah, the uh, awful thing about this guy is that he drains health. Cool. Every time he hits you, he is uh, draining health. Yum. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so yeah, the personal heartbreaking acts for the animal here was, was definitely... I mean, all the animals here were very amorous. Hmm, this is um, true. So there's a decent chance that this animal uh, lost its, like, partner in this fire. There were a lot of coupling animals. You, the day that I came to your forest, was the most important day of your life. For me, it was Tuesday. One, one plus, two, three. I believe that should be an EX combo. I think so. Which is why I skipped the two plus. Yep. I throw out that health. We'll see if I pay for this. I have her. You did knock him down. When you are at full, you can do a full one, two, three. Yeah. Oh, oh. Ah, okay. there we go. I wasn't too bad. We kind of stayed on top of him, and he didn't kill us the way that Hughes did. Yes, yes. The main thing about that is if you're not able to damage mm -hmm. him, mm -hmm. he will, like, slurp up health, but he yep. doesn't, like, truck you anywhere near as hard as, yes. as Hughes, right? <laughs> the only thing that keeps you alive in the Hughes fight is that he doesn't have any AoE. But, uh, I think everyone knows what time it is. Yeah. Soggy. Hang on. It's almost over. Going nasty mode. I <coughs> no. My head. To be fair, I do feel like we left uh, at a rather exciting moment last time. Yeah, we're getting our ass beat by uh, by Wiseman. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> well, Gilo, I guess that sucked actually. Sonny, you're the only one who can do it now. I know. Just be quiet. Shut the fuck up. Whoop! Oh, she got tossed. Somebody got ragdolled. Millie, wake up. I'm all right. What about you? 
You look so pale. Uh, I'm fine. We are definitely not about to get pulled into the past. My head hurts a little. That's all. The... Uh, uh, I'm doing great. I'm not about to throw up on your dress. <laughs> Drop her. Hmm. Just, just drop her ass. Hey, uh, hey, Soggy. Is he throwing up now? You doing okay? Oh, jeez, oh, Soggy, jeez, Soggy. Oh my goodness. Oh, everywhere. That's nasty. That's nasty, Soggy. Wicked Wing Rebels. Ooh, that's a, that's R O Gilo with mm, wings. That's a nasty Gilo. I love a nasty Gilo. Mm hmm. It's amongst us. This whole magnation plan of his is insane. Probably fine, right? Well, I don't know about you, but I had a great day. We're no match for Wiseman's power, are we? What now, Seth? Do we back down? So, yeah, we don't actually end up fighting Wiseman here. He just whips out his magic dick and we're like, "Ah, oh, oh, never mind. Good. Have a good day, sir." Let's go back to Naos. I'll have to think of something else. Alright, so I don't think there's anything else here in Kujam. Anything new. Power of the heart. We're just heading the to power Naos. of the heart. I don't even think there's like new dialogue. I guess you could feed the foul we layer. We could get to stinky though. Yeah. And we're still yogurt here. All right, foul air. Ah, this is a shop we didn't go to. Huh? Ooh, some dank herb powder. Does look like it's all stuff that we already have. Ah, yes! <laughs> we don't actually have a thirsty sword on us because we upgraded it. That's fun. Alright, well, back to Naos, I guess, and figure uh, out what yeah, to do next. Yeah, sort of figure out how to fight Wiseman. He's so strong, we didn't even get to fight him. No? The only enemy in the whole game. <laughs> well, it turns out that in this world, if you believe, you really can do anything. There's no place like home, even a dingy home like oh, this. Oh, we can get some frozen rain to, to feed to Pac-Man That's as well. true. Pac-Man loves a nice cold drink. At least here we don't have to deal with lunatics in love with their hearts. It's weird, though. No one's around. They must be down below. Yeah. Oh, yeah, for sure. Hey, we're home. <laughs> That's strange. Let's go down and look. Hmm. Oh dear. Funnily enough, you can still go to the Colosseum from the distant past. Yeah. Which, um, uh, hmm, don't worry about it. Presents some questions. No, don't worry about it. Weather vane, fern, house two. <clears throat> oi, 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 oi. 
Ooh, that one didn't look great. Sure. Up two more of those. And we should get another one. Reward, that is. You know what? Sometimes it's better not to know how the sausage is made. Hello, Duck Prince. <laughs> wow, Soggy. Judgmental launch? Ugh, freaky. I'm the Duck Prince's super snuggly, fabulously fluffy bed. But he'll get mad if you sleep in me. Eh, don't we all? This town's a little weird. That's a little strange. I mean, it's very bait and contents, though. There's some very strange towns in one. Mm-hmm. Well, this one might take the cake, though. The clay cake. Surely we can class up at this point. Probably. Yep. All right. Congratulations. Class level 14. We still have not purchased an aura. Not really sure we ever do. I guess if we uh, have trouble in a boss fight, we can always... Uh, if there, and if there's a blue one nearby. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. All right, well, um, I think I've put it off long enough. I don't check everything out. Chris. Quiz, hang on. Uh, he just fucking killed them. He didn't even, like, Magnus them. No. He just fucking killed them. Just murder. What an asshole. Wait, I'll use magic. It's no use. Her heart strength is slowly giving out. It's no use. What happened? Why is this happening? Louis. Wiseman. Motherfucker. He tried to, to turn us into madness. Oh, okay. He tried, and we were like, no. We the best we could, but it was useless. He killed anyone who resisted. That's awful. He is a real fucking piece of shit. He's a right fuckhead. Seth, I held on for you. I held on. But I... But I... It's all right. You don't have to fight anymore. We'll use our magic and fix you right up. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. Just let me rest... a little. Oh. Man, Wiseman's a real piece of shit. Wiseman's a right dick. Yeah, we, we've heard about War of the Gods and stuff. No, no one has ever mentioned Wiseman. No. Which is so strange because he's... Clearly pretty central uh, here. He's clearly a really nasty fucking asshole who mm -hmm. is doing a lot of murdering in the past. Mm-hmm. And I mean, out of everyone here, he sure does seem the most, uh, godly. Yeah? Given that he's a strange bird energy thing. And he ain't exactly human anymore. <coughs> Why? Why did it have to come to this? Wiseman, that son of a... I can't bear it any longer! I'm going back. 
I don't care if it kills me. I'm taking Wiseman down. Wait, Thorin. Don't you dare try to stop me. You saw what he did to Quiss. How can you stand by and do nothing? I said, wait, Thorin. We're going to Zaurak. Do what you have to do to get ready. Zaurak? But that's... Seth, you can't be serious. Oh, I am serious. And don't call me Shirley. Oh, I am. We can't contend with wise men unless we have their help. Their help? So Interesting. No? You'll know once we're there. Come outside when you're ready to go. I'll be waiting. Alright, so we don't know what that's about. Hmm. Recruit you. I'm gonna look at the globe every single time. I'm gonna get that freezing ring feature our Pac-Man during this uh sad, sad moment. It picks a creature leaping out of the water. Not a fish. Ah. Is it oil? Mm-hmm. That's the whale? That's it's a uh, bat and kytos. That's a whale that swallowed an entire ocean. It's a cephalid. Here you go, Pac-Man. Yum yum, freezing rain. Yum yum. We fed it the rotten, uh, rotten apple, right? Yes, we did feed the rotten apple. Okay. No response, it's just a corpse. So yeah, there's even a disembodied guy here. Yeah. And everyone else is just dead. Time for a revenge quest. Ah. Oh. Not everyone. Yeah, well, she has to stick around. You can still uh, get the, uh, uh -huh, yeah. the quest there. Yeah. And the shop is also still nominally here. Well, I think we're all ready to go. Let's do it. Alright, last dungeon of disc one, let's go. Mm. Thank you, Clouds. Taking us out to Zaurak Peak. Mm -hmm. It is kind of cool that you get this like giant world map here. It's very disconcerting. Just save here first. Well, that would have been a good idea. <laughs> this is a dungeon, at least, so I'll be able to pop out. Hmm. Colorful. It looks a bit meat forty. Uh, you know, maybe it always ends in meat fort. I I do think uh, the ending in meat fort is pretty common. If, if your Act 1 doesn't end with, or, or at least Act 2 doesn't end with a meat for it, then what are you doing? Slapsies. Oh, well, why not? Nice 
Aha! Defense. Perfect. One eight hundred. Are you slapping? Pretty sure you're dead now. Ooh, that was a lot of damage. Many bats in this world. That's one of them. Mm-hmm. It was three of them previously. We were like just fighting these enemies and it's about to. Mm-hmm. But these are much older. Oh yeah, sure, sure, sure. These are the distant ancestors. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Adapted to live on land. Good lord, we are getting so much more TP now. Mm -hmm. Anyway, if you don't like them, how about zombie skeletons? He was my cup of tea. out of here. You're gonna make me go across town for this, huh? Yup. Oh, Jesus. I probably shouldn't even do the hit here. Gostero. Oh, he's dead, at least. He's definitely dead. Sometimes it's so hard to, like, turn yourself away from the big combos. Many Soul cal Calibur characters have the big combos. I like how Soggy's picture's gray like it's an in-memoriam. <laughs> I mean, he is dead. Not fucking doing it. I should have actually because there's only one of them now. Yeah, get wrecked, idiot. we're getting a new Magnus here. A Trigon Band. Good anime. I love a Trigon Band. This is a third as many cards as we could hold. Alright, if you're gonna take dark damage, no you're not. Ah, yeah, that's fair. Those are also really hard to equip because it's like, are you even gonna get damaged? Yeah. When you use them? Hmm. Right, we can't go in there yet. We can it to the east. All right. Oh, there. <laughs> we. <laughs> Their skulls pop up. Their skulls do <laughs> pop. <laughs> he sneaks like the Grinch. <laughs> <laughs> You're not wrong.
wrong. You awake yet? May my place be sharp. Nah. Still gonna happen. <laughs> tragic. Oh, it was a little tragic. I think he's dead though. He's a little dead. He's not only merely dead. He's really quite sincerely dead. Why didn't they fight back? Because they were asleep! Yeah, you literally <laughs> jumped them in their sleep, Kilo. Kilo! I don't know what to tell you. Kilo, we deliberately attacked them while they were asleep. We're the monsters here. Alright, uh, it looks like there's an up and a down along with this chest that I just got. Alright, ascension. Uh, jump up. Ah, Ven. So yeah, Ven's gonna wait here while we go up and explore the dungeon. Ven does have a turtle shell. Rather than wings. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> that creature! Face down, ass up! <laughs> The game really bailed the, the, me out for picking Harley, the wrong person The heart of the cards came through for you there, for sure. I'm going to kill this thing. <laughs> it's like a bunny clown? Yeah, it's a <laughs> juggler. The Yugler. One. Oh, <laughs> it loves giving me that shit. Oh, we're fine though. I'm pretty sure it's still dead. You know what? I don't want to learn nothing about what a juggler it's can do. Still ass down on the ground. Still ass up on the ground, I guess. It has never not been that's ass a, up. That is a very Mookie pose. Yes. That's so a Dominic Deegan ass pose, right? Ah! <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Ruthless. Am I wrong? Rhyme Blade. Ooh, that's a three. Mm -hmm. We did actually get two uh, new supers. Yeah, first three for Soggy there. That's good. Mm-hmm. Mercilessly slashing at the enemy. Ooh, I do love a, a Rhyme Blade. Mm-hmm. Not a Reason Blade. It's not a Rhyme Blade. It is a Rhyme Blade. All right. Is there any other special we want in there? I'm not sure what ending this it. week. Apparently um, that's our second I, copy I of Rhyme Blade. I can tell you there's no boss at the end of this dungeon. Mm-hmm. Um, so we're actually fine for a while. Adjust things around a little bit.
Poor Millie doesn't have a, another one, although she does have Rising Condor, which we haven't actually seen yet, so let's throw that in the deck. Why not? Oh my god, they're always asleep. Oh no, I woke them up. It's very easy to go a little too far. I, it's surprisingly hard to sneak. I, I've tried it myself. It was it was very difficult. I failed. See, everyone? I, it's not I, just me. I, I fucking failed <laughs> miserably at it uh, in the very first dungeon of the game. <laughs> All right, well, fuck this guy specifically. Yeah, he's a little dead. His weird face chest. Okay, why not? Also, fuck this guy! <laughs> oh, hell yes! They made Gilo nasty! Jesus. <laughs> All right, I got an evil male. Ooh. Hello, would anyone like to uh, have their evil male delivered? I do love my evil male. All right, where am I going for my evil male? Am I jumping down? Now, hard to see shining dark ladder on the right. Use that to get down, then head up and down. West, jumping up when you can, and making a second jump for the chest. Whoop. Oh god, that's weird. At the fork to the west. Plasma blade. Mm-hmm, another really sword for Soggy. Man, we're getting some fun stuff in this nasty so, zone. At the west, take the upper pass first. Okay. I will be useful a little later, yep. So the well, there's a boss that started disc two that is weak to lightning. Yeah. Um, otherwise, you know, you can use what you want to in this dungeon. Uh, we'll have time to prepare a deck for uh, this truly annoying boss fight. <laughs> All right, upper path. Yep. Go down the ladder, find finisher. Good lord. There's a there's one there. There is a holy one for. Ah, wow, we're getting a lot of light and dark stuff. That's weird. I keep both fun. Yeah, fuck it. Nasty mode Gilo. Head back up. Right to the south. So we can fall all the way down for another check. The enemies are really grouping up here. Well, the juggler's like hanging out in packs. That's you know? true. What's a juggler if they don't have an audience? That's a... Ah, that sphincter's open. It sure is. Alright, eat wet. Cross Sophia! Oh my god. It'd be very funny if all of these things are strong against dark. But that's not gonna stop me. I don't know what everything really is in here. Oh, it causes sleep, so it's good no matter what. Never mind. I don't give a fuck what it does. Probably in the, the light one. Yeah, the enemies like being put to sleep for once. Yeah, fuck them. <laughs> you don't have to fight them. I've managed to avoid most of the fights for a little bit. Mm 
good. I romancy. Juggler's fucking dead. Mm-hmm. You woke up and chose violence against jugglers today. Correct. Look at this thing and tell me it doesn't bloom it. Hey, hey! That's new. True Heavenly Bloom. That was not on purpose, but hey. I guess it was just the right specific combo. Mm-hmm. We got a uh, Gilers and Claw. Level five. Almost fucked it, but I didn't. I mean, that doesn't seem unlike what could happen in the Bank Kaitos universe, to be honest. Exactly. He senses the heart of battle. And it's like how in Pokemon, Professor Oak follows you around, telling, telling you no. Telling you to fuck time. off when you try to touch something you shouldn't. Uh, yeah, it's just, there's just, everyone who goes out and fights is a, is a fighting game announcer following them. Mm hmm. That was a we lot are getting TP. so much Ooh, TP. Oh, and a lot of cool items. See, it was worth it. <laughs> I mean, if we're getting a lot of lightning weapons. I wonder if the game is telling us something. <laughs> the game is extremely telling us the next boss is weak to lightning. <laughs> the next boss is a pain in the fucking ass, apparently. <laughs> I can't wait. Well, that's actually a little bit. Mm. Depending on how long it takes us to get to the dungeon side of the, the story, we'll see if we get to it today. Alright, well, I can wait. Okay, so at the save point, and uh, there appears to be a Machine mirror of center. light. Machine Center. There's something on the southern side you can turn to move the light. Turn it oh. to the turn it to the left. Oh, oh, and light powder, yeah, fuck it. Something else to feed to Pac-Man. Pac-Man, I've got some powder for you to he, snort. He does like to eat light powder. Boosts light offense but lowers dark offense. Ah. Oh, interesting. Well, eat up, little guy. <laughs> At a 90 degree angle. There are tracks we can rotate it. Fuck it, get rotated, idiot. But yes, here's the gimmick of this dungeon. It's the Kingdom Hearts is light. Move it to the left? Yes. Okay. It says start by moving it to the left so the beam is pointing at the south. What if I, like, didn't do that then? <laughs> what if I pushed it the other way? <laughs> like. It I, I guess, hypothetically, you are pushing, like, the, the pushing action that is occurring is going towards the left. Oh, I mean, but... it is going to the left of our screen. Right, you know, like, Soggy is moving to the left, but I, I feel like you could have said anti-clockwise. I this is clockwise. This is clockwise. <laughs> you could have said anti-Wittershins. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Take that path to the entrance. 
go find Ven Wayne. Ah, yes. We, he did say don't forget about me. Yes, you do actually. We do actually need to pick up Ven. We mm -hmm. cannot leave him behind. This yeah, whole because thing, he's good and useful. This whole thing is like just so you can get Ven back. He's a good boy, and how could someone possibly suggest we leave him? Uh, me. I'll suggest we leave him. Wow. And the game decided. Destroyed. I can't believe this. Ven slander. I do hate him. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> no, that's a lie. Jesus! <laughs> I don't mind him. <laughs> it, it seems rather arbitrary that he can't fly up the cliff, so we have to make this entrance go back for him, but you He's know. He's got a turtle shell on his back! Uh, he might be dead. Nope, he looks fine. No, they're not, not gonna heal Hilo. That's a little harsh. Yeah, I am. No, alright. <laughs> Ooh, got any eggs combo. Oh. Oh! Yes, I, I kinda oh, thought, like, I, I was throwing the light and dark okay. in on purpose. Mm -hmm. yin and yang. Oh, the wings! I do love mm -hmm. Hilo getting wings, bat wings. Hilo gets nasty, and it's so good. Sorry, I maligned you. I was maligned. Uh, you were. You I were. don't deserve this in life. I mean, you might deserve it, though. I don't deserve it, man. I, I don't know about that. Oh, yeah. One plus. Two. Two plus. Three. He doesn't even fucking give me a special. You assholes. Yeah, so EX Heavenly Bloom is quite easy, actually. Uh, was it a specific attack type, or...? It doesn't seem like it, or if it is, it's just three normal attacks. Mm. Yeah. Get the ass, Elo. Heavenly Bloom or True Heavenly Bloom? I believe it was True Heavenly Bloom. True Heavenly Bloom is weak attack, medium attack, strong attack, and B. And uh, okay. Whereas Heavenly Bloom itself is just Heaven Fall Ice Bloom. I think that that was what I got the sa the first time I did True Heavenly Bloom. I will take a quick look at these jugglers and uh, our field guide. <laughs> we do have to go and show our field guide to the guy at some point. It's been like a hot minute. Well, yeah, these guys to... are weak to darkness. The Skeleton Warriors, this may shock you, are weak to light and strong to darkness. The Devil's Doll is weak to light. Oh, goodness. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, light is, uh, Kingdom Hearts is light in this place. Sneaky sneaky. Oh, we're so sneaky. Aren't we? Hey, Ben. All right, so we've acquired one Ven. Thank you very much. All Never right. went down. Ah, that's because there is no because down. Is no down, down is fake. Yeah, down is fake. Wow. <laughs> I knew that. Uh, I just didn't tell you. Uh, no, 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 fine, Ven. Head west and north to reach the machine again. You're going, yeah, you're mm -hmm, going back. Mm -hmm. to the machine. Um, I'm going to grink step past this guy first, but yes. Don't like the way you're walking. <laughs> Zoop. The guide wants us to take six light powders. Uh, no. Not, not a chance in hell. Where in the fuck is this guide getting six spaces? I mean, it's not doing Pac-Man. <sighs> this little fucker. Remain in jail. I will take three. Yes, it will age, but apparently you can upgrade gear with it. Ah, okay. And you need some to get through the dungeon. Mm-hmm. Well, potentially after we use it there, we can come back for a little more. All right, and I have fed him light powder as well. Yep. So where am I spinning this thing? That way. <coughs> Oh, 
open that sphincter. I do have to get the cutscene every single time, yes. God, that takes a bit. You may want to remove uh, something a little dark. So many sleepies. Where are we headed? Into that fight. Into the fight. <laughs> Give you time to look over. Go to the west on the screen, climb up and find another chest. And there's a boulder to the and then there's a boulder to the northeast. Alrighty. Any light finishes you have will be pretty uh pretty powerful. <laughs> Luckily Gilo does in fact have those in spades. Not against these guys, though. These guys specifically are the one thing that is stronger against uh, That's true. light than dark. Soggy is always poison. Hey, Soggy is a bit there. like Lena. He just enjoys the, the taste of poison all day. Mm -hmm. Seeing these results, it's hard to disagree. May my blade be sharp. Ice Actually, only one way I can go here, up to the north. <coughs> Ooh! Squad, 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 Maybe they won't notice me. Oh! Yeah, that one was clearly doing a, doing a, a sprinter's like kneel when they get the start of a race. Ready? Ready? Go! <laughs> On the plus side, Gilo is about to blast one of these motherfuckers. Yep. Two hundred damage. <laughs> okay. Once again, I'm gonna kill the shit out of this guy. I would use healing, if we had any. Well, see, this guy's dead, and that guy on the right probably is pretty damaged after this light attack. Farewell? No, dead. He's dead. <laughs> Turns out doing 300 damage to someone is generally pretty effective. As strategies go. Alright, so. Say so yeah, up the cliff to the left for a chest. 
And then, so the reason why we needed to get Ven is Ven is the only one ah, who can deal with that boulder. With our stupid so, bird. Uh, uh, if you had left Ven behind, we'd be like, nah, it's too heavy, meh. Oops. Meh. We need the big boy. Damn, dude. Blasted it with a laser. All right, so to the south here, you can sprinkle white powder. Sprinkle it with a little white powder and it uh, solves everything. But now you have to ah. run all the way back around and sprinkle light powder there. Of course you do. Well, thanks, fucker! <laughs> Good job! Later, bitches! I didn't think you were gonna get, uh, get past, but, uh... Neither did I. You got it. <clears throat> Alright, so you sprinkle some light powder on the bridge, take some more, and then send it to that And then sniff head. that shit, yeah. Once you get through that door, uh, it, the, the past will end. It's ogre. Ugh. It's ogre for you. We got like a roulette wheel thing going here. Yeah. This whole place is a little bit strange. Off we go to wherever we're going. It does, this guy does go back to where Hughes was to hey, pick up that chest. Who are we looking for in a place like this? They could stand to redecorate. No kidding, and also to patch the ridiculous draft that's in here. Keep your mouth closed. There's no place for jests. It is filled with jugglers, though. here? Tell me. Come on, who is it? Thorin, you're so Knuckles the Echidna coded. You'll see. Just be quiet and walk. Hurry up if you don't want to be left behind. Alright, I'm coming. Anyway, we just gotta keep it mysterious for a little bit longer. Yep. It's another of those headaches. <laughs> yeah, we're, it keeps cliffhangering us uh, in the past. Yep. Dropped it on us. Dunked him. <laughs> I love him though. What, what a lad that guy is. So, anyway. He's adorable. I must admit, <coughs> I didn't think you'd be able to kill an afterling. Very We've impressive. killed like four. I, I don't know. We're not usually the one who does it though. Okay, yeah, but we do the hard work and then they come in and steal the kill. This is no time to be patting them on the back. I mean, I don't know. It seems like a time to be patting me on the back. I deserve it. I think not. Now why don't you hurry up and finish them off? Yeah, they've been in a past reverie for the last... That's what I wanted to do in the first place. Yeah, Shanath, you're really the one who got in the way here. Hughes is a competent professional. And you've got a clown show with a Malpertio monkey squirrel. Yeah. All right. No pleasantries this time. It's over! It's over? 
One pleasantry this time. Who are you? Lolo the second, at your service. And stuff. Soggy. You alright? Uh, wow, Palolo, you got fucking arms of steel. Just holding back a jetpack. Holy shit. Palolo got hit in decks. Hello. He did say he was going to saddle suit, so. Yeah. The way he is, he really needs to, like, spin him so he can do the get rotated idiot. Go on. Get out of here. Before things turn uglier than Kabari's face. Well, something just aged. Can't hold him off forever. Thanks. We owe you. <laughs> no, Biggie. Get rotated, idiot. Wait, what? <laughs> he disappeared? Yeah, that's actually pretty impressive. He got the full Naruto. There should be a piece of wood here. Afraid I can't hand those three over to chumps like you. Sorry. Bye bye. <laughs> bye, bye bye. Smell you later. <laughs> he does have smell you later. <laughs> Energy, it's fair. That was kind of hairy, eh, Soggy? Hey, eh, Soggy. Do you expect this kid to be a recurring character? <laughs> Always put yourselves in mortal danger. Or I mean, Palula III is literally in the original for like five seconds. Yeah, like it, he is. He does not have art. He is just an NPC who helps you at the very start. He has a voice oh, though. Thank you so much. There's a decent number of those. If you'd shown up even a second later, we'd all be dead. Nah, I was there the whole time. I was just waiting. Yeah, dead's not so good. Well, next time you'll just have to be more careful. We'll try. Thanks. They also just gave him the smarmiest nerd voice, which is wonderful. <laughs> no problem. Anyway, I've got a whirlwind to catch. Hope to see you down the road. <laughs> Odd kid. No kidding. Sorry. Shouldn't, shouldn't you report, report to Varys? Yeah, but let's rest a bit first. We're all beat out pretty bad. Well, and also, like, if Hughes just came after you with his jetpack, he'd probably die. We can report to the Quaestor once we get back to Fair Cod. Fair Cod? Oh, is that how you say it? Fair Cod? I, I, mean, I, I feel like it's been called Fair Cod before. <laughs> I'm not sure that's been the 100% consistent. <coughs> That dude is really loving explaining things to those gray thorns. Oh, they're into it. It's me. I was worried. Why haven't you called in? Uh, I was getting killed I was out getting here. My ass beat. I'm sorry, sir. We weren't able to stop pro machination in Sadal Sud. I see. Another machina armor. Kinda seems like you just suck nuts. <laughs> Guy does not know which one of these is correct. How about some fucking help? I imagine it's the top one, but uh, yeah, no, I thank you. I also work. Yes, sir. We're not strong enough to beat an armor by ourselves. Not yet, anyway. You give us a little time. We'll get there. That's all right. Come on back. You can give me a detailed report. Oh yeah, you can go back and get that chest. Ah yes, which is <laughs> just the stupidest thing in the world. <coughs> Callous, isn't he? I almost died, and he says, Good work. Huh? You could hear him? Uh, yeah. I have good ears. You've been on speakerphone the whole time, Soggy. <laughs> Everyone can hear you, Soggy. Good ears? What are you talking about, Dingbat? Show me where you have ears. I mean, really, Gilo. <laughs> You almost died? G Gilo can oh, hear, so Gilo must have some done. form of ear. Soggy, that's it. She's due for an eating. You have to, to let, let me. me. I can't, can't take, take it anymore. anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I love the I love the English voice oh, acting for Gilo. Voice, it's yes. so good. Wah, wah.
Make sure it's safe out here. Yep. Uh, I know in case the like, guys are wrong and we do, we do in fact have to fight that dude. I know he's here somewhere because I'm pretty sure he's an optional fight. Yeah, what they do with these guys is like really weird. Yeah, yeah, there's a rematch with, with you in the valley somewhere. Whoa. Whoa! Excuse me? Whoa, who's that round boy? Who's that Pokemon? <laughs> well, he's got a little, little wiggly camera. We're gonna have to go see him. Whoa, Roly Poly! Ah! Just don't talk don't to him. Don't mind me, sir. Just don't talk to him. Got it. Saber Dragon Saber Horn. Dragon Horn. Beast Fang Cut. Mm -hmm. Restoring Battered Weapon raises the durability of equipped Magnus when used. That's gotta be for some really specific decks. <laughs> Sure hope this thing isn't Omega. I guess we'll find out. <laughs> He's thirsty for blood. <laughs> yeah, I like that, the knife that kills you from last time. Ah. Oh, love syrup. Oh, that's not the same thing. Yeah, the like, the dew isn't like really around anymore. Pardon, sir. You're getting two love syrups? Oh, well, I guess one is one is going to Pac-Man. <laughs> oh, that's pretty much what we want anyway. It's because we have so much powder. Yeah, yeah. there we go. So it's light powder. It sifts between light and dark powder. Okay. Um, both of which are used for, like, Magnus upgrades. Mm -hmm. So that's the thing we should go look at once we're out of here. Uh, see if there's anything we want to upgrade with light or dark powder. Mm-hmm. The boss fight at the start of Disc 2 is, is notorious uh, across both games for being like one of the nastiest fights in both for both games. Hell yeah, I don't even remember. Uh, you'll remember I'm once I'm sure we I'll get know as soon it. as we get there, yes, but I I don't actually currently. Uh, that is, uh, it sure is something. Not dead. Hurt. I may regret that. <laughs> Maybe this is Omega. He's hurting. Good, because things aren't looking great. <laughs> Listen. I should did not do that correctly. Uh-oh. Yeah. It's so fucking weird to me that like you have to target revive. Revives don't revive. Like they instantly. shoot they shoot they really auto should, target. Yeah. And so, it's it's a little ridiculous. Especially in one know. this like like a battle system this fast. Grab some more for funsies. You never know when you might need some love syrup. Syrup. Cut it close, but got there.
There was no... Nah, his fat ass These is in the These are no enemies, actually. They are. Gormer! That's a Gormer. Oh, that was a Gormer. May my Gorm be sharp. That is not the one I wanted to hit there. That's a little unfortunate. Isn't it? Yeah, these fights seem to be kicking your ass. I don't think you're supposed to be back here yet. <laughs> these are very hard hitting. I just did like 400 fucking damage in one hit. Yeah, we might be. We in might danger. be dead. Thank goodness I made you save before coming in here. Oh boy! If I you, think we're dead. If you come back here for the I um, uh, don't fight anything. <laughs> Yeah, I think we're about to game over here. Hey, don't come back here, got it. Jesus! <laughs> Holy shit. Game over, yeah! I mean, you don't have to get the... ...move the item now. Today we all learned. <laughs> Guess we don't have the love syrup, but that's uh, all. Do we have dark powder to feed to Pac-Man? Yes. Okay, I go ahead and feed that. All right, let's look at some upgrades. Woo! <laughs> Jesus Christ! Wow. Oh man. Yeah, no, they don't expect you to go back, which is strange because they put a chest there. They, they like they like put those, a whole new set of those enemies. Those enemies hit like trucks. Like it's a totally new map. Yeah. Everything about that is baffling. Like I don't know why it's not like done on the next disc. Right? Oh uh, yeah, so you've got Ray of Truth here. I imagine that's not massive. We've got Blind Element. We've got Minor Heal Element. We can make the coat even more defensive, but like, by a very small amount. <laughs> But we could beckon the world There's to help. There's like a lot of stuff that upgrades the light powder. We might not have it yet. Uh, mm. Light Sophia does. We do have a light Sophia. Um, it does not appear to be in this list. Like, there's one in the deck. If it's in the deck, it won't be. Yeah, there's probably like because I, I like the Epistolos in here too. Although I don't know if I have two of them. Uh no, that uses Yesterbeam. Ah. Fuck up sword, iron dice, golden cudgel, light Sophia, nurse's cap. Um, hmm, interesting. I do feel like we have that 
somewhere in our hats. Maybe not. It might not do. I don't know yet. I mean, maybe we just couldn't see it. And yeah, the Ray of Truth, the Blank Guard, the White Club. Yeah, like a lot of that stuff we definitely don't have. Yeah, it does not have that as an option. Yeah, that's... Like, I wonder if different ones actually do have different... Lists? Different shops. That would be really weird. It unsorts itself? What does deck usage mean? How does this upgrade nurse's cap and... Oh my god, yeah, different shops with different sets of things that can upgrade! <laughs> that doesn't seem great! Why? Hmm. <laughs> list anywhere? Oh god! Oh good lord. Oh, we have not read mail in a bit. Oh lord. Oh lordy lordy. Alright. Alright, Teak, how you doing with the whole writing things thing? Hello, Soggy Teak. Watch you, Gina Millie. Gilo, 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 yeah, Gilo. The, the upgrade guide does not have the list of what, you know, shops. Where things are upgraded. No. He seems to like Gila's name the best. He's learning, though. Oh, from Gina. You have to just bop around until you I... find one? Sure seems that way. Are you getting along with Milliard all right? You like baseball, son? I worry sometimes that you still don't understand girls too well. You're on a hard journey, mister. Don't you and Gilo go charging off at your own pace. Before you race ahead, make sure you take the time to look back and let her know you're there. Love, Mom. Valuable info! It's our big mid-season sale! We're slashing prices at Magnus shops across the sky! Potions for 250G? I don't think so! Just 99G for a limited time only! Snag that Magnus you've been lusting after! Why? Because you deserve it! <laughs> oh no! We got an expired coupon. Aww. <laughs> the Sadal Sued Frontier. Visit Eternal Ruins. Witness the historic majesty of Sadal Sued on this three day tour. Enjoy a simple lunch while you watch perfect white clouds roll through the streets of Faircod. Faircad? Faircat? I don't know. Hike through the exquisite forest Faircod. of Nunky Valley, which is now on fire. Pick mountain apples outside the farming hamlet of Celebri, then move on to apple wine tasting. And, uh, actually that's it. That's, that's all there is in this place. For more information, contact the Faircod, Faircad, Faircad Chamber of Commerce. Every place tries to, like, advertise to us once we've been there. Oh, no. Giacomo! Yeah! Soggy! I know what makes us different now, a power beyond simple human strength! I'm going to find that power, then I'll come for you. Mark my words! Oh, my. Love, Giacomo. Love, Giacomo! <laughs> <laughs> I 
Dear Soggy, you'd be fucking dead if I didn't do this. <laughs> Yikes. Dear Soggy, losing to that guy was cringe, but I saved you. Pololo the second would say yikers. Like, so I get, the, it's weird because the guy's like, go upgrade, but like, I think we might not be able to upgrade until we progress. Probably worth checking. I'll check in Celebri at least because I believe that also has a shop and see mm -hmm. if it looks different. Mm -hmm. Oh, this guide writer is like, most people find the boss are just too very tough. I don't. <laughs> just too instantly because the boss and many people think it's extremely hard. I disagree, but you might not. <laughs> Thanks, bud. Most people are scrubs who don't know how to build their deck <laughs> or play their deck. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. This guide is not for babies. Because the other guy I'm using is like, I was stuck on this boss fight for like two days. Many people do not like or want well, the, me posting. The other thing about this boss fight is uh, you, I don't you think get that might actually a... not be a card shop. Uh, is it not at the left start of town? Oh, it might be. Like that one? Doing okay, ma'am? Eh, uh, she's cursing the butterflies. Damn. Oh, she's cursing Lit. the soldier. Ah, fuck that guy. Oh, fuck that guy. Ah. Oh, she doesn't have an upgrade oh, option. None, then. <laughs> Fair enough. We do have to go back to Muntaka to talk to Varus. Um, and we probably want to pop back to Hassela to uh, hand over the field guide. Yes, it has been a bit. We should probably get to at least the next tier of that. So uh, we can definitely you know, check the Hassela check around shop there, as well. Yeah. I'll, I'll pop in there first. It's very unclear whether the upgrade thing is like specific shops or if or it's like time. progress. Like... I think if we see another one... And it looks about the same, that should tell us. But I do think that, like, that there did, weren't water elementals in there, I feel like. I think it was just the light and dark ones that I was seeing. Not that it's easy to tell when everything's grayed out. Oh, you are going to fucking enjoy talking to Varys. I always fucking enjoy talking you to Varys. You are going to fucking enjoy talking to Varys. <laughs> Alas, no more bean. Yeah, we fed it. Bean over. Bean over here. Bean over here. Alright, how we doing? Oh ho! Mm. <laughs> Alright! Harp of Slumber! The Sleepy Harp. The Sleepy Harp. Alright, how we doing? Nah, not enough for the fourth. Come back when you're a little, hmm, richer. <laughs> Alright. Do you? Yeah. Uh, Even less! Yep, yep. So yeah, okay, it is different shop. by shop. My guess is that also should be the furthest along right. shop. Mm -hmm. So my guess is if we can't upgrade uh, like the nurse's cap and stuff, it's because we need to get like to the next continent. Yeah, further on. That's a little unfortunate. A little, a little sad. But uh, it's not going to be that much of a problem shortly. Mm-hmm. As we go back and talk to Varus. We're all set.
It's really weird that it would work that way, because, like, you have to have the Magnus to be able to, like, craft it, you know? As and strange, you have to have the item. I honestly think we never interacted with no, this No, we, we almost never upgraded stuff, because for the most part, like, your quest Magnus is filled with shit all the time, you know? And, like, it's just, like, how often is the weapon going to get be going to be very useful for very long? Yeah, like you can get some really good stuff, like the Mars Sophia we have with like way more attack with and stuff. But it's like that's that takes a lot of effort, you know. Man, that's basically the same as the uh, Oscillate Shop. Yeah. That's so fucking weird. But yeah, like you will just you know outclass it with the stuff that you pick up. Yeah. Regularly yeah. and like you probably have noticed, but the biggest difference between a lot of the stuff we're getting is just the element. They've mm -hmm. all kind of settled on about the same attack level. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, and as we go a little further in the game, that attack level will go up, but like, not by that much. It's a weird system that you don't even really have to do, but you can get some fun stuff with it. There's definitely, like, you know, a lot of rewards for real deck-building sickos in this game, but, like, it can be a little bit of a pain to actually spend the time collecting all the cards and theory crafting when, like, you can just beat them up by putting your best numbers in and constructing your deck in such a way that you can do big combos. All right, Virus, we fucked up. A little bit. We are, we are trash garbage at this. Sadal's suit has fallen as well. Mm-hmm. The Machina Vanguard has forces in both Diadem and Sadal's suit now, which leaves but one continent. Anue Nue. Their queen, the fairy guide Corellia, is not an easy person to run over. I do love Anue Nue and Corellia. What does your guardian spirit think, sir? She says it's essential we secure the Fairy Guide's help. It would certainly behoove us to try. <laughs> the Queen's assistance Thanks, could the tides in our favor. <laughs> Surely someone could stop this. <laughs> Sagi, fly to Anue Anue. Oh my god, this guy, like, escorts the man in Monkey Valley now. Oh! <laughs> Oh no! Yeah, like, you know, maybe, Marius, maybe you should recruit some adults. Right? Not children. I children and a murder puppet? I mean, I guess the murder puppet, but. Mm -hmm. Keep the murder puppet. Good. <coughs> I'm counting on you. Yes, we're being given our next uh, task, which is just go to a new enemy. Going to a new enemy will start this too and, and get that really hard boss fight. Which you probably want to spend some time preparing for. Mm -hmm. And uh, probably don't do now because apparently it's very long and we got all the scenes for it. Yeah. And maybe want to like... I mean, we could probably finish up now, right? I want to find some quest magnets because, uh, hey look, Burr! I told you you would like this. I, I kind of figured what you uh, were, I, what you meant. I told you you would like talking to Varys. Mm-hmm. Because uh, we were so fucking oh, foolish. Oh my shit. good god! Yes. All right. You do want yeah those two up there trap him. Yeah. So a big thing is. That was like Z down. Yeah, well, mostly it's like if we wanted to move him down here now, it's probably a good idea. Sure, if sure. only because now, like, we're gonna have a bunch of slots below yeah, that's him. Fair, that's fair. Where, like, we'd have to come in here every time. Imprison him! But back into jail, Pac Man. I wanna put the Millie poster in the bottom. Yep. Okay. I actually want. Up is this just so I can like see it on the regular. We're salt now. Once that salt. heart grows up. Salt, salt. Ah salt, yes, the salt, salt water salt. has ceased to be water. It ceased to be water. It's now it just. It is now just salt. It's just salt. Our yogurt still yogurt. 
And it's got a bit to go before it becomes cheese. Despite the fact that we have not refrigerated it at all, it is doing just fine. So we could go to the lava caves, pick up a rock fly corpse, two rock fly corpses. Mm -hmm. Feed one to him, get an Udomosh with mm -hmm. another one. What sort of recipe we can make with an Udomosh? Yes. But I don't remember what the other thing is. Oh, yeah, the next just kind of pain me ass to get. Sure, we can definitely make some of these things. Like salt and a terrible song. I don't I think don't we've know, seen a terrible the, don't song. Don't know what the terrible song is now. Don't know if we can get soot. I get soot after fires go out. Hmm, maybe. Empty book and a medic kit. Salt and the boulder. Oh yeah, blazing stones and flaming stones. Ah, now you mix a blaze and withered branches. I guess we just need withered branches. We've of course got stones and chunks of rubber. Apparently you can get suit in the northeast house in Greater Mintaka. Suit and suit and suit and suit and suit. It's easy. Finally, something to fill all our quest magnus with. in the jar by the edge, apparently. It says, in jars near northeast house, in jars near door. There's no jars near door. How northeast we talking? It means northwest. <laughs> they really should clean this thing up. Oh, we can't even go into northwest because it's Gelda Blame's house. You're once again banned from the premises. It says the jars in the house of the dancing family. Oh, ah, yeah, so south, I meant southeast. Of course it did. Yeah, you know. I mean, at least it wasn't southwest. Yeah. I hope everyone's ready for some unforgettable soot. One, two, five to mix and one to, uh... And one for one, the fairies. One to feed Pac-Man. I can't believe we could have gotten soot this whole time. Every one of the fucking Magnamix recipes we've had has soot in it. <laughs> Not that many. Every single no, one. No, it's just like two or three. Sixteen of them. Salty water and soot is something. Which is funny. And this one's for the angels. Uh, you can get salty water in the urn in the room next to Virus's office. Yes, I think I did see that. Okay, well, uh, we can make ourselves some salt. Fuck what, it, let's make do, some some recipes while we're here. What does salty water and soup make? I guess we're about to learn our chemistry. I see a lot of fights for the soup, though. Yeah, it's it's gonna be sitting on the back burner for a for a hot minute, but that's why <laughs> we've got two of those. That's fair. All right. Salty water. Make some salty bets with this. I keep thinking Pac-Man's just gonna eat shit if it's here. <laughs> but no, we, we have moved him. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. He hasn't eaten the soot yet. Can we get another Paramore secret from Almar, do you think? Maybe. Are right, getting stuff in that desert town to feed to him? This is this is the end of the stream. Is feed Pac-Man? Hey, we might like we're about to finish disc one, so we might as well go around cleaning some stuff up. Feed him, feed him, feed him. He's a growing Pac-Man. He is a growing Pac-Man. We should definitely also go back at some point and like talk to him, uh, or uh, you know, show our Pac-Man off.
I used to be a pack boy, but now I'm a pack man. Okay, so what if they still have the secret, or if that's a one-time thing? It's not much of a secret anymore. Yes, yes! Feed it to Pac-Man! Feed it to Pac-Man! I guess Pac-Man can eat gossip. Yes, he can. Pac-Man can eat anything he puts his mind to. He can't eat a cell phone, actually. Yum, yum! He doesn't want to eat the cell phone. He's considerate enough to know he need that. Yes, we can feed him a rock fly corpse and some Udemosh. Yum! <laughs> Just bop around getting a bunch of shit. Feed it to Pac-Man. Random crap. Mm-hmm. Hey, Pac-Man, would you like to eat bugs? I wonder if we can... I think Meat Fit for an Emperor was in the Emperor's house. Oh, yeah, this is fucking awkward as shit. No fucking it is, kidding. It is there, yeah. This is oh, where yeah. I got it's, it. It's further but off, it's, basically. It's so awkward. <coughs> Alright, Pac-Man, eat up! Nom 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 nom! Do you think they actually put bugs in the bug juice? Yeah. Oh. That's weird. You're just fighting for funsies. Oh, I've got a bunch of Magnet Mix That's recipes to true. do! It's true. May my blade be sharp. It may. You never know. You don't make promises here. Honestly, it's probably a good thing that we don't have, uh... A relay? Yeah. Though, frankly, we are getting our ass kicked. <laughs> you don't really get defense in this game. You can, it's just usually a bit of a waste of time. <laughs> well, I mean, like, leveling doesn't exactly level your defense. No. You don't have, like, accessories to do it. Yeah, the only way to survive, we get extra survivability, is, uh, get more health and level up. Who said you should help? I did. Alright, fuck it. Excellent. Win. Let's see I did win. <laughs> I kind of always forget she calls Kilo a dingbat in her mm -hmm. victory quotes, too. Always right, and so forever. Alright, so the, the Udemosh guy's in here. Yeah, that guy. You give him some yogurt. Sure could. Alright. That's Rockfly, Corpse, and Ush. Oh, shit. I get egg. <laughs> egg. I'm always egg. asking this. Egg. It's just egg. You know, egg. This egg. is a cloud and this diadem cloud. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the ones in diadem are special. A specific diadem cloud, mm -hmm. I guess. They're tasty. You know? Uh, there is the, like, sparkling snow. Yep, yep, mm-hmm. It's expensive, but worth it. We, we have so much way. money. I think we can get it elsewhere, but fuck it, we have so much money. The worst part here is actually just walking up to him. Yeah. That's not a thousand gold. Badge. Ouch! Pay the man. Yeah. Yeah, no, no, no. We're feeding that. We're feeding that to Pac-Man. Oh, 
It's not for me, it's for my boy. For Pac-Man. Oh yeah, the Emperor's Palace will also have rubber? Yes, delicious rubber. Which so... also mixes with rocks. Oh yes, uh, not that we can do that right now. Um, but yeah, so we can feed him some rubber. And feed him some meat fit for an Emperor. If we also grab, like, meat or something and then it rots, we'll get rotten food. Mm hmm Which he also enjoys as a treat. And it doesn't matter if he enjoys it or not. <laughs> He's getting it anyway. Mm-hmm. Yum, yum, yum. Oh, yeah, yum. Yeah, that, that'll rot into some rotten food. Yum, it's trippy. I think in Mintaka there's also like Machina gas and oil. Yes, I believe so. I mean, I, did, I didn't manage to sneak past him. I killed him. Wow. <laughs> Damn. Drinking water. Yeah, I don't think we're done drinking water. And when he finishes his meat, we'll let him we'll wash let, it down. We'll let him drink some more. Mm-hmm. And it's gone. And then wash it down with some nice rubber. Yum, yum. Mmm, delicious rubber. Rubber smell. <laughs> yeah, leave him just stink up the place, it's fine. Alright, anything else to get in here? Here? I don't... Uh, no, I'm, I'm basically just... I'm doing my best. We're eyeballing it. Nah, I'm fine. just throwing stuff out there as I find it. Mm-hmm. Ah, fit, fit for an emperor. I could have sworn there was some of that uh, in here. Ah, yes. We're taking the whole spread, baby. It's been a while since Emperor Olgan passed on. Oh, there's no trouble. <laughs> Ooh, fight, 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 fight. Bail height or virus. It's talk of town. Alright, uh, do we feed him a chunk of rubber or yes. fruit fit for an emperor? A chunk of rubber. Alright, start with the rubber. <laughs> Because I've already marked it down. Because <laughs> I know that, like, the houses in Mintaka have, like, gas and oil yeah, and stuff. Yeah, a bunch of random shit in them. They help you get kick-started on your crafting. Like, jolt shrooms as well, I think. Yeah, although it was temporary when we first did it. I do wonder if it's like now a permanent source. We'll see source. if it's grown yeah. back. I mean, it's been a bit, so... It's kind of like it'll grow back. It'll get better. It'll get better. Alright, so... Ah, he hasn't eaten it. the rubber? Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. I feel like it was the one above. I think it's but upstairs, we fed him yeah. fire. We might or might not have, we honestly. Fed blaze. We fed him a blaze, a 420 blaze it, but I think we have not actually had a fire. A ah. Blaze. I, I don't know which things are like flame and blaze. There's like, there's varying levels of it. I think if you like. If you let it sit, I believe it will get lower. Yeah. So if I catch it, that's good. If we just find fire, then that's fine. <laughs> Yeah, we get flame from aging a blaze. I close that. I hate when I click on a tab and it 
Mm. Because the X is... I was saying I have too many tabs. Rude. Alright, so I have just fed it the fruit fit for an emperor. Alright, mark that off. But also, us, too many tabs, there's no way. <laughs> yeah. He hasn't bit yet. Was the thing? Just... Machina gas? So like... Oh, Machina gas? I picked some oh, up. Okay, okay. Nice, the doesn't appear to be gone, gone yes. Yeah. yeah, I know that, like, uh. Ludovan's house has, like, oil in it. Mm hmm. You got that earlier to fix the, uh, the thing. Yep. Chilling on the roof, buddy? What do you want? It's cram! Will ya? Are guys still arguing? Yeah. Please, my wife. I right, definitely feel it mac and a gas now, I would have. All right, knocking a gas in the chamber. Uh, uh, hi. Uh, yes. They're, they're, yes. They're learning <laughs> how to milk cows. Okay, okay. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <laughs> All right. Yes. <laughs> I've never seen this. <laughs> no? Okay. Oh, I can't make the cow go moo. Yeah, so the oil was on the right, I believe. Yeah. There we go. No Machina oil. Delicious oil. Pac-Man washing down uh, his dinner with some machina oil. Mm -hmm. Alright, anything else you want to do? Or do we finish up there? I think that's pretty good. That is not a bad right, place. Sorry, consider what we want to do for the outgoing boss. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, so you can potentially prepare for it off stream, get a deck together. Mm -hmm. right, that's a good Kill it on a wonner. And while we're there, we can age some of these uh, Magnus and. Uh, do some Colosseum. Do the mixin'. The schmixin'. There's the Colosseum counts. Towards the fights for the mixer. I feel like I it probably so. does, but we can do science for it. I mean, we can report back to everyone on Sunday. We've got a whole week to ignore doing this. Mm -hmm. But I think we're gonna finish up there. All right, tomorrow is more Ace Turning Investigations 1. We made it to case 5, uh, which I'm just going to assume is the longest case in the game. In the series. Uh, and ever. I, I mean, considering how long case 3 and 4 were, I have to imagine it's the longest case you've ever experienced in your life. <laughs> so, see you for that. More of this on Sunday, where we're going to fight... I guess the most notorious boss across both games. That's kind of impressive considering the Giacomo triple fight exists. <laughs> yeah. Terrifying. Bye everyone. Have a good one.